physicsacademyonline.com we teach physics in an interesting and engrossing way let's see an example like when you say about distance so you see that dimension and units are quite different commodities but it's possible to know one i mean to derive one of them if the other is known that's really helpful now the topic of this lecture is the problems on pulley block system and wedge block system so first of all let us introduce the first question on pulley block system here so this is the question and this will be first question in our discussion now and i number it 1 the question says the figure shows a pulley block system placed on two smooth inclines we are not considering any frictional force until now in our lecture so it's smooth inclines our material is absolutely genuine and especially developed for this website our audience mainly comprise of students of advanced school level and introductory university level we believe that physics continues to be a very important subject for all science students who want to pursue their career in general stream in engineering or in medical courses in physicsacademyonline.com we ensure that our students learn physics in the best possible way without leaving any room for confusion in our website we will clear the physical concepts the laws the formulae the principles the tricks and shortcuts to solve the problem with suitable innovative diagrams here i construct the figure here is a dog in front of this sledge and suppose Uh, this is the belt that is connected to the neck collar of the dog and this is the sledge front a rod is there and you can see this is the way the dog is pulling this sledge okay it happens when we have got a hard object hard round body uh, trying to roll over a flat and that is a soft surface like you can imagine the case of a billiard ball that rolls over the table cloth that soft in such case what might happen as you can see that as the ball is sitting on this soft cloth a hollow is being formed under this ball and as a result the cloth gathers together and forms a small heap in the front of this uh, this ball the ball tends to move to the right so that our students attain grip on the topics to begin with we will teach our students how to apply their knowledge in solving problems of basic to moderate level later on we will come back with the same topic to solve more difficult and more challenging problems where they will learn to interweave many physical concepts and formulae from a plethora of choices to reach the solution carefully so you can see that i have highlighted my last result and this is this vt thing is called terminal speed and is given by the gravity force acting on the body sinking body divided by the constant in the expression for the drag force now what does this speed mean to coming back to what i was saying earlier equation number 2 told us that with time the value of acceleration makes the v larger and larger drag force becomes larger and larger at a certain point dv dt acceleration becomes zero and from then onwards the body falls passes to the fluid with a constant velocity constant speed because there is no further change in v because simply dv dt has become zero Now the topic of this lecture is the problems on pulley block system and wedge block system. The force of tension in the string that remains the same throughout the length of the string is given by simply m1 and if you could take common that is coming out to be inside bracket a plus g sin 30 degree we have got the value of m1 here 2 kg it has been found just now 0.837 meter per second square g is 9.8 sin 30 is half 
show that the value of t is coming out to be 11.5 Newton uh, up to again three significant figures. Now that is the tension in the string at any part of its length because it's taken to be massless and the pulley massless and frictionless. These are the two answers of this question. We strongly believe if students follow video lectures regularly and clear their doubt effectively through physicsacademyonline.com, they will attain enough expertise to perform confidently to reach their academic goals in board level examinations or any competitive examinations anywhere in the world.